hair lousy. We go hard in the city and county. We catch head up face wearing brownies. Doing burpees in the yard like the county. Oh, what you talking about, sensei? Me and my soul, old caliente. Cash at me, them bank days, bank days. Knock your hair off your head like an essay. What it do, what it do, y'all? Thank you for tapping in one time. If you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell one time. So today we're gonna tap into it real fast. You know, um, as you can see, as the title says, uh, you know, this is something that somebody asked me the other day. And I was like, nah, that's a good question, but nah, that, that don't work. So I'm gonna break it down for those who are like curious. So if you get in any type of trouble or whatever the case may be, and this is, I know this is for sure in California. It might be different everywhere else, but I'm thinking it's still the same, but this is California, you know. I'm from California, I'm from LA. This is uh, something I know for a fact. And I even ask people just to make sure, like maybe there's been a few times shit slid through the cracks or, you know, shit was accepted. And, and even people I asked was like, nah, that ain't, that ain't never happened. So what am I talking about? is that okay if you get any type of trouble let's say if you would you go to jail and like i said this is shit that i know from my own experience as well as me talking to people like to confirm like you know if something happened before you know it was an exception so let's say you're a white boy you go to jail uh you run with the woods right uh, some white boys don't be racist. Some of them just, they just white boys. So they still run wood. They might not be uh, A, B, or, you know, all that other organization stuff. So they're not really racist, but they got to still run with their people. I know because I've met white boys that was cool. They, they, they not part of that, but they, you know, they got to run with them. Then some of them, you know, convert and do all that. That's their choice and get involved in all that politics and all that. <clears throat> Um, there has been a few white boys that I've seen that slid through the cracks. Um, like one white boy I was, I was uh, locked away, he was a crip, so he was hanging with the brothers. The white boys was on him, they was giving him hell, but we know the brothers had to have his back. We had to always watch him and tell him, hey, if it go down, you gotta be the first to, you know, get off, cause all this is going on, all this, all this, uh, you know, all this tension going on because of you. But he was down with it, you know, he was a cool dude. Uh, so if you're like a blood or a crip white boy, you might be able to, you know, ride with the brothers. As well as the Mexicans. They got white boys that be serenos, you know. So I know for a fact, like with blacks, we don't trip. You could run black and be white, Asian, Mexican, whatever. If you, you know, if like you a crip or a blood or you just fuck with us on that level, you just gotta let it be known and you gotta be ready for whatever. The same with the Mexicans. I know for a fact the Mexicans, they just like the blacks, they don't trip. They got a lot of black Southsiders. They got Asian, not even Asian Southsiders, Samoan Southsiders. Uh, uh, what else they be having? White boy Southsiders. I met a few white boy Southsiders. Uh, and they not mixed, they just regular. You know, some of them be mixed, of course, but, you know, it's more acceptable. But, you know, it'd be regular black dudes that ain't mixed, regular white boys, Asian, you know what I'm saying? I didn't, I didn't, like, I didn't, the Mexicans, they like the blacks. If you, they, you fuck with their card, you run with them, full throttle. You know, you might have a little more shit you gotta deal with, but you good, though, at the same time. Uh, but the white boys, they don't accept, I don't, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't, they might accept if you like mixed with Mexican and white, but I know for a fact, <laughs> if you black and white and you trying to run with them, nah, they ain't fucking with you. Yeah, they ain't fucking with you. You gotta be fully white only. They the only card that accept only white people. And I respect them for that, but at the same time, that gets, just goes to show the level of bullshit they be on, racism and level of, uh, they not, they don't want to fuck with nobody. And that's cool. That's what they want to do. It just shows, but I'm saying it just shows you the type of shit they be on, the type of time they on, you know? 
you white and black, you want to run wood, because for some reason you one of them black, you one of them mixed niggas that don't, don't like niggas, they is not fucking with you. At least in California, from what I've seen, even when I hollered at folks to see if, like, hey, you ever seen that happen? Like, nah, that ain't never happened. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if this ain't the 60s where uh, a nigga uh, write white on this thing and he, he mix with black and he slide through the cracks and go, uh, you know what I'm saying, work at the job or he live in the house with them or he, he be with them and they accept, or like, you know how they had the females used to always slide through the cracks back in the day and they'll be black and white, you know, Creole, different things and they slide and they act like they just pure white. Not They ain't got no black in them and they do, you know. In jail, they don't play that shit. Uh, but that's the type of thing they run on. So, uh, <clears throat> yeah, that hopefully that under... Uh, from, maybe it's other people out there, too, that, you know, was wondering that, too. Because my homeboy, he asked me that. Uh, he, he from out of state. There's one cat I know. So he was asking me about California. And I said, I, I never heard nobody talk about that on the Internet. I, that's, a, that's a good topic. So, uh, yeah, you know... That's that's the thing, man. The, uh, <laughs> if you a brother and you mix and you don't want to deal with the brothers, you can go hang with the, the South Siders. They accept you, or, or you know, you got to do some shit. Uh, otherwise, you, you out of luck. You gonna get, get your ass fired on, <laughs> do some burpees, some cow time, uh, and do do you do whatever you got to do to get your ass up out of there and never go back. Cause that ain't the place to be anyway for nobody. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but it's all love and respect. Uh, you know, jail is all about respect. It don't matter what you run with. It don't matter who you are, where, where you from. None of that shit matters. They got hard niggas and busters from everywhere. So from all walks of life, all different races, you know. So I, I respect everybody. That's that's what it's all about. You know, the county jail is a little more disrespectful. Everybody know that. And go to, you got to go to prison or something like that. It's, it's nothing but about respect, you know. White boys respect you. Mexicans, blacks. Asian, Samoan, whatever, you know what I'm saying, whatever, everybody respects everybody, and if somebody don't respect you, even if they don't like the color of your skin or where you from, whatever, so it all boils down to respect, it all boils down to being a man, standing on your ten toes, keeping your word, if you do some bullshit, you're going to have to deal with the consequences, hopefully it ain't too bad where you end up in some bullshit that you can't get out of, other than that, it's all about respect on all cards, all races. That's what it's about. You learn respect when you go to jail. You respect white people, you respect black people. You, you're gonna respect everybody or you're gonna get dealt with because you're gonna put that, whoever you is with, you're gonna put them in jeopardy and nobody wants to deal with that because it can cause a riot, it can cause a lot of bullshit. You know, people can die, like shit get real serious. So you can't play around. It's all about respect. So respect your elders, respect everybody. And you have a, you you be cool, but the most important thing is stay your ass out of jail. Don't be trying to get caught up in that shit. If that's what you want to do, do your thing, <laughs> and be ready for all the drama that come with that bullshit. Other than that, man, everybody out there, I hope I answered the question for other people that might wonder about that shit too. But other than that, man, everybody have a blessed day. Stay humble, stay safe, stay positive. Get your money, do your thing, man. And most definitely put God first. That's what it's all about. Till next time, y'all. One love. Peace.